In this video, I will be teaching you how to read and write decimals up to hundreds place. So first is I'm going to teach you how to read decimals. For example, we have this decimal number 0 0.3. And so this is how you read it. And so observe that we have a number 3 at the right side of the decimal point. And so this is 3. And then we're going to put the place value of this uh, number. So it is located in the tenths place, so it's three tenths. Now how about this? We have the same number at the right side of the decimal point. It's still three. But then it is located in a different place value. So we have a number three the right side of the decimal point so we're going to put three and then uh, the place value where it is located it's in, in the hundreds place and so this is three hundreds now how about this we have 0 0.25 and so we're going to start with the whatever is the number at the right side of the decimal point that is 25 and then the place value but then we have two numbers here and we have that means we have two place values it can be tenths or it can be hundreds but then the rule there is to only always use the rightmost uh, place value so the rightmost place value here is the hundreds place and so we're going to use hundreds so it's going to be 25 hundreds so how about this now we have a whole number and a decimal so it's 19.5 so how do we read this so we're going to start with a whole number which is 19 and then a decimal point so for the decimal point we're going to read it as n so it's 19 end and then the decimal part so this is 5 and it's in the tenths place so we're gonna have 5 tenths so the whole uh, decimal number is 19 and 5 tenths another one we have 64.09 so how do we read this? So we're going to start with the whole number. We have 64. And then a decimal point, which we read it as N. So it's N, 64N. And then the number at the right side of the decimal point, which is 9. And then the 9 is in the hundreds place. So we're going to put hundreds. So all in all, it's read as 64 and 9 hundredths. Another example, we have 58.46. So we're going to start with the whole number, that is 58, and then a decimal point, which means and, and then the number at the right side of the decimal point, and so this is 46 and then the rightmost uh, place value is in the hundreds place and so we're going to put hundreds so the whole decimal number is 58 and 46 hundreds so now let me teach you how to write uh, decimals given that we have uh, words and we're going to translate it into numbers so this is how you do it same way as uh, the vice versa i'm going to start with the whole number so this is 25 and so we're going to put 25 and then the word and means the decimal point and then eight tenths so we have 8 and in the place value tenths. 
So that is 25 and 8 tenths. Another example. So we have 44 and 6 hundredths. So let us write it in, in a number form. So we'll start with a whole number, 44. So 44. And then and, which means the decimal point. And then 6 hundredths. So that means the 6 must be placed in the hundredths place. So we'll put 6 and 6 is in the hundredths place. That is 44 and 6 hundredths. Another one, we have 17 and 12 hundredths. So we're going to convert this into decimal number. So let us write it. So let's start with a whole number 17. So let's write 17. And then and, which means the decimal point. And then 12 hundredths. So we're going to write 12 and make sure that the rightmost number should be placed in the hundredths place. So we have 12 and the 2, which is the rightmost, is in the hundredths place, which is correct. So that is 17 and 12 hundredths. Thanks for watching, and I hope you have learned from this video. Please support my channel by pressing the subscribe button, and also write the math topics you want to learn on the comments section.